Edfu Temple, the most well-preserved temple, and of course the second biggest as well. As you can see it, uh, tall pillars, large facades, and such well-laid carvings. Uh, today episode is going to be the most exciting because I'm going to cover Edfu and Karnak later. But to just focus on here, it is as I mentioned has multiple uh, layers. You can go upstairs. There are stairs. then these carvings and the sanctum is so clear and so well laid out uh and colors are also have started to appear uh and when you see karnak then the story is different but let me stick to edfu uh we are climbing up and just enjoying the sunrise hitting the the temple for its vastness and for its massive structure edfu really really stands out built 3000 years ago what a sight we now go on the cruise for 6 more hours i am with captain hasan the uh, the captain who is navigating for us for 3 days i wave at him and we make friends and then we land after 6 hours to the karna complex it is called because there are 30 pharaohs who have contributed to this temple the sphinx uh, the structures the ramses uh, there is nefertari nefertiti uh, everyone contributing here hats is put the queen who you will see in the next episode and we are taking this small circle uh, you can see the obelix behind us this is one of the standing uh, single granite stone there are uh, three of them uh, massive massive obelixes which are the testimony for the engineering more than that it's the belief they carried that they can construct anything build anything and make it happen this is guys karnak for you